A clinical trial was conducted using a new method designed to increase the probability of conceiving a girl. As of this writing, 942 babies were born to parents using the new method and 869 of them were girls. I want to use a 0.01 significant level to test the claim that the new method is effective in increasing the likelihood that a baby will be a girl. So half the time you're going to get a girl. So that's what this null hypothesis means. My alternative says, I think you're going to get a girl more than half of the time based off of this data. On this one to find this test statistic, I'm going to go into stat test because this is 869 out of 942 I know that that's a proportion it's definitely a Z right because it's a huge sample size so I go into the proportion this P naught is my hypothesis value which is 0.5 my X is the 869 my sample size is 942 and I just have to be careful here because this has to match my alternative and I calculate and I get a Z value of 25.94 holy moly right you're not gonna find that value in a table in other words this P value here is zero because there's no way you're going to find, when you look in a table, most of your tables don't go past what, like 3.5? And so this is basically saying that this, well, let's go look through the conclusion. So we're gonna reject the null hypothesis because the p-value of zero is less than 0 0.01. So definitely there's sufficient evidence to support the claim that the new method is effective increasing the likelihood that a baby will be a girl because this is such a high test statistic here okay which basically says our probability is very low I mean it's basically zero